Let's blow your whistle. Slipping it through. Shots on here. Oh, good save. <laughs>Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, uh, I'm going to be doing, starting off my career mode with Bolton Wanderers. Uh, from the likes of JJ Okocha and Stelios Giannikopoulos, uh, they have been basically, I wouldn't say free fall, but they, they've fallen down. Next season, they will be playing football in League One. Football League are to blame. Um, uh, entirely for me, they they shouldn't ever have allowed it to get to this stage. They shouldn't have allowed Ken Anderson to take over. Whoever is in charge of checking the fit and proper test, they need to do their jobs properly. That's just what I think. But today we're going to be doing a Bolton career mode. I'm going to be starting off. I'm going to be doing preseason. I want to know your transfer suggestions. Um, I want to know who who to sign. I am going to be playing it on ultimate, as you can see. Uh, four minutes for preseason. I'm going to be going for the one with the most money, so that's going to be European International Cup 2.2 million pounds potential prize money. Not bad. So that two million could then become four million. Okay. So first thing first, we check the expectations. Youth development medium. Sign one youth player to the senior team in the same season. Grow two youth academy players. I'm not sure if I'll be doing that one. Uh, within three seasons, increase season ticket holders, rad, avoid relegation, easy, financial high, ooh, we can't, we don't have that much money left to spend, um, right, let's get rid of these emails, now the, this is what I always do for my scouting instructions, I always go, First team quality, 16 to 30. That's on first one. Second one, I'll go first team quality, 23 to 30. Minimum uh, contract, 0 to 1. And then I go promising between 16 and 22. Um, and then that's my scouting done. That's my, uh, yeah, scouting process is done then let's next up we will go and take a look at the squad um, very happy with regards goalkeepers um, Ben Williams is a bit old but Ben Anik I like the Ben's Ben Amos Ben Williams Ben Anik uh, Remy Matthews is a good goalkeeper I know he's he's very good um, Put in a brilliant performance against Norwich. Then right back, we have Pavel Olkowski and Mark Little. Both of them are getting on a little bit, but we're, we're they'll do for this season. They'll be good for this season. Um, centre backs: We are thirty-one, Hobbs twenty-nine, Wilson thirty, Beavers twenty-eight. We'll be looking to bring in a youngster at centre back. Um, and all of them's contract, all of them have their contracts expiring as well. Same as Mike Little, um, Andy Taylor contract expiring. Jonathan Grounds on loan. He's, Andrew Taylor's thirty-one. Muscat's twenty though, so I will probably be training him. Defensive midfielders: we have Jason Lowe, who can also play right back. He's twenty-six. Gary O'Neill, thirty-five. I know about Gary O'Neill when he played for Norwich. Callum Connolly, but he's only on loan, I think. And Joe Williams is twenty-one. Oh no, maybe he's not. Maybe he's not on loan. Cool. Um, we've got Joe Williams on loan. Sammy Amiobi, very good player. Scored against Norwich. I remember that game very well. Uh, Craig Noon, right mid. I thought he could also play left mid. Maybe not, but he's 30 years old, so... Again, with a lot of these positions, I will be looking to bring in some young, younger players. Uh, by the looks of it, there's a lot of bringing in youngsters. Uh, Luca Connell looks decent. Only 17 as well. So I can't complain about that too much. Um, Luke Murphy, he's 28. He will 
probably be going... He'll probably be playing. Do we have... Yes, we do have attacking midfielders. Good. A few youngsters here. Um, not sure. Maybe maybe Jack Earring might be able to do something with him. Maybe Luke Connell. On the left, Buckley, Wiltshire. There'll be good good competition on at left mid. Um, and then up front, Clayton Donaldson, 34. Josh McGuinness, 27. Um, Connor Hall will be training him as well, probably. 17 players will be gone by the end of the season, um, as it stands. I will be offering contracts to players like Josh Faylor. Um, who else was there? Maybe Jack Hobbs. Maybe probably Mike Beavers as well. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it goes on. So we're going to train them, and they will be at least throughout this video, unless somebody makes any other suggestions. There we go. So this is the team, starting team. Actually, wait. No, we put Elliot Ostuma in there. Right. So we got Matthews in goal, Taylor left back, which I think left back is the position where we most need somebody. Um, Beavers, we are uh, centre back. Olkowski right back. Connolly Williams holding with Ostuma attacking midfield, Buckley on the left, Amiobi on the right, and Josh McGuinness up front. Then on the bench, you can see Anik, Little, Hobbs, Baylor, Noon, Lowe, and Donaldson. So, yeah, let's do pre season. Who we got first? Ferenze? I don't know. I don't even know if that's how you pronounce their name. Uh, we will simulate. Simulate the first two. Okay, we got past that one. Will Buckley get in the goal? Transfer offer for Connolly. 1.55 from FC Basel. No, thank you. Lorient away. And we lose 2 1. Okay. So Ben Williams is 58 rated. Um, so let me know if you want me to sign him. Let me know if you want me to sign any of these. Greg Dog T is obviously on loan anyway, but he's 67. And Alfie Jones is 63 rated. Um, I would definitely look into signing Alfie Jones. Uh, we're going to rotate a little bit. No, we don't. Okay, the captain C will go to Jason Lowe. <laughs> KFC. Come on, Bolton. Let's not lose to KFC. Yes. Straight through the legs in the end. Josh Vader through to Clayton Donaldson. Oh, Yannick Fulshire. Remember that this is on ultimate. Okay, apparently he just doesn't want to take the ball with him. Oh, good save by Remy Matthews. And that one was straight at him. It goes out wide again. Oh. Yes, Yannick Vilchet scores. 1 0. And it looks like we're progressing as it stands. Oh no. Oh no, he's just done me. Oh, never mind. McMurphy. Oh, that was way wide. Okay. Um, looks like we're we're going th progressing at the moment, but we're not doing the best. Yes, come on, bullshit. Play one loan from not. That's a red card. Oh, maybe not a red card. That was a foul, surely, though. I'd love to know how the referee decided to not give that. But, Jason Lowe. Oh. Udegby with a good save. Right, let's corner in. Kind of away. Not really. Beavers. Oh, oh, what's... Who was that who just 
dived. Oh, that would have been Donaldson. Oh, Vela. Oh. If only Bolton played football like this in real life, there'd be nowhere near. Nowhere near the relegation zone. I'm going to see that again. How far back do they play it? What a nice one touch. Bit, just one touch from like three players there. And in the end, Josh Baylor puts the ball in the net. 2 0 to Bolton. Oh, Clayton Donaldson header. Yes. 3 0 to Bolton. Game over. Excellently placed. Fine goal. Well, it wasn't just about the quality of header. That was good enough, but the movement that allowed him to find that space, that was the good bit. Again, it's on. Ostuma on. Williams on. Amiobi on. Hobbs on. For Wilson. And Olkowski on for Little. Wait, actually. Let's also replace Remy Matthews. Ben Anik can have a run out. Strong, powerful clearance. Oh, Josh McGinnis with a great header. Amiobi. Amiobi. Oh, there's two minutes. Yes. Okay. Now, can McGinnis. With great vision here. Got his shot off oh, no. How did he miss? I think that was Ostuma. I didn't actually look. Oh, this has had the commentary going all game, hasn't it? No. <sighs> Three minutes of added time. I'm pretty much up. Ref, blow your whistle. Oh, good save. Right. This should be the last bit of action. There we go. Uh, ref, blow your whistle. Here we go. Right. 3 0 win. We're into the next round. And next up, we're against VVV Venlo. So Scott Kashka is uh, 63 rated, but he can also play striker as well as right wing, which is, for me, a key thing. I would want to sign Scott Kashka. But I would sign him as a striker. Only problem is he's injury prone. But you might be able to get him cheap. So if you want me to sign him and Delphi Jones, because obviously we need to reduce the average age. Also, I might look to offload a few players because there's a couple of positions where we're pretty much like over full. Maybe try and get rid of Ben Williams. Oh no, it looks like he's retiring, is he? Or he's just joined. I don't know. Um, so, yeah. Right back, we're fine. Centre back, we might be able to get rid of somebody if uh, if we bring somebody in. So if we bring in Alfie Jones, somebody like Mark Wilson or Wheater or Hobbs may be able to go. Uh, if we bring in... If we bring in a striker, so if we bring in Scott Kashka. Um, or, or any other striker, let me know who you want me to sign, remember, uh, then that would make it so we have three, so I'd be comfortable with three. Might look into look to bring in a young attacking midfielder on loan. Uh, left mid we're fine, central, cent central defensive mid we have a few too many, but one of them is Gary O'Neill. But we've also got Luke Murphy can play there as well. So I don't know with that one. Uh, let's sim this one. And then if we get to the final, we can play the final. We lost it 3-2. And McGinnis is injured. And Buckley missed a penalty before then scoring a penalty. And we had Taylor sent off. Was not a great game for us. Let's have a look. 
Right, so we've got a further 704,000. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't reach, reach the final, blah, blah, blah. Player injured. Two months, Josh McGuinness is out injured. So it looks like we do need a striker. Now I'm looking at the, the situation. I think Scott Cashcut would be a decent one, but I want to know if there's any good youngsters that I'm missing out on here. Well, it... Certainly looks as though we are going to need a new striker and my camera's about to die So I suppose that's a good time to leave it and In the meantime, so I will see you guys in the next video Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and until the next video <laughs>